the U.S. for the first time since 49, Ingrid Bergman sacrifices some of her brief 34-hour visit to a truly feminine gesture before answering a question about future roles. Well, I've been asked to do pictures and plays here, but it has never been the right, uh, the right thing to do, nor the right time. And uh, Anastasia was really the first thing that just worked out perfectly. Is, is this the guiding factor, getting the right play or the right picture to bring you back to us here in the United States? Yes, maybe. <laughs> Later, the star of Anastasia is presented with a golden lifetime pass by master showman Robert C. Rothafell of the Roxy Theater. A thrill followed by another big moment as the New York film critics make their 1956 awards. I'm Irene Sire of the New York Post, chairman of the New York Film Critics. On behalf of myself and my colleagues, I'd like to present to you our plaque, The Best Acting by an Actress, 1956, your performance in Anastasia. Thank you very, very much. I'm deeply moved and very grateful to the critics. And I'm very happy that, uh, that I came over to take it in person. Well, we're so <laughs> glad you could come, and we feel honored, too. Thank you. It's one of the most coveted motion picture awards, and the Swedish film star who will do another picture for Anastasia's producers is obviously pleased. 